So we're out here right now in Orchid Thai. The usual. Eating some summer rolls. We're out here because it's my birthday. And my parents didn't want to go to Yarn House. This is Tom Yum soup. None of us have ever had it before. It looks good. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be good. So. We're all gonna try it for the first time. Yum yum soup. How is it? It's a it's sour taste. It's yeah. hot and sour soup. With so we got drunken noodle as well and the nasal fried rice. Good morning, everybody. It is March 18th, 2017, and to Saturday, Saturday. It is officially two days, two days, two days until I move down to LA. Um, I apologize that I haven't been vlogging much, I'm trying to do the packing, I'm trying to window shop for things that I need, I'm trying to buy most of the stuff up here because the sales tax is cheaper than down there. So I guess I'm just gonna vlog the whole packing process and picking the stuff that I need and want for LA. So let me just show you some of the stuff that I have packed so far. All right, in this box, we got my food scale. We got a pot down there with some knives, silverware, plates, I say plates, glass Tupperwares, a baking pan, some tall beer glasses, I mean juice glasses, and this old school Mr. Coffee for coffee. Let me just show you. Look at that, that's ancient. I wanted to get a coffee uh, maker, but my mom was like, oh, we have one, and she gave me this, but hey, it's never been used, and it's probably gonna work just fine. Who knows, we'll see. Packed one box. Ooh! Costco's gonna be missing out on one of their best packers, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Just kidding. Okay, I did some more packing. A uh, bunch of toiletries. Okay, so you know, we got the Q-tips right there, soap, shaving cream. Managed to put the rice cooker right here. Cologne, perfume, toothbrushes, toothpaste, allergy meds. I went to Crunch. I asked uh, if I can uh, make my home gym a different one to a home gym down in SoCal for the meantime. The employee was like, no, unfortunately, because those Crunch gyms are a different corporate or a different franchise. And then I was like, oh, but she did say, if you decide to cancel your membership here and go down there, they'll waive the enrollment fee for you. And you know, you'll just pay, uh, you'll just be paying monthly like you normally do now. I'm like, oh, I might have to do that because I don't know the gyms down there right now, but uh, I do need to have a gym membership. And I think Crunch will be like the transition I'll just go to a crunch down there for a while until I find a different gym, a better gym. Since I haven't really been recording the whole packing process of this move, I think I'm gonna show, I was going through my closet and I think I'm gonna show you all the plastic bags that I've been hoarding. It's kind of nostalgic. So here we go. Major Laser. Ed Sheeran Shape of You Remix. Love is the best place to find the lovers of the bar. Working out my, my thighs right now. Back to the plastic bags. Ida's off-campus college books. This was the store to get your books at when, you know, you're at Sierra College from 2009 to 2012. I got two nice Nikon bags. Three mainland bags. I don't shop there, but before, or I don't shop there now, but before, I guess I did. Got a couple lids bags. Cause I used to buy hats that were fitted. See if I still have some. Uh, what's up? <laughs> I don't even know what school this is. What? Uh, it's a college though. Oh, hold up. My mom is calling me. We're gonna have to take a quick break. Uh, my mom and I. 
are going to Target to buy some more stuff for the new place. Um, we'll continue this uh, bag haul, this bag hoard, when we come back. Okay, I'm back. I don't know what school this is. Um, I don't care. What I care, what I do care about, are the signatures that I got at a show uh, before in UC Davis from like YouTube singers and rappers. Let's see if I can name them. I don't know. Oh God. All I know is that there is some from JRA, Traffic, Lil Craze, Erica David, Joseph Vincent. I don't know. I'll probably try to find some pictures of the, from that night. I didn't have anything else for them to sign, so I was like, just fuck it, just sign, just sign my hat, I don't care. Back to the plastic bags, of course. Zoomy! Yes, Forever 21! Got the black bags and the yellow black. Blah, yellow bags. Target one, Converse, Apollo one, Beachworks, Vans, finish line. Gotta keep the Nike bags. Now, how can you get rid of these? Like, they have drawstrings, they're nice. Boom, like that. Come on now, it looks like a trash bag. Lululemon bags, nice quality bags. The Walking Dead bag, got that from Comic-Con. Walgreens bag, I don't, I don't know where I got this. Urban Outfitters, they're just nice. You can use this anywhere, for anything. I remember getting these bags for the first time, I was like, whoa, these are not plastic. These are top. Look at these bags by Apple, okay? Ooh, they're like gym bags, they're like, Okay, are they called kinch bags or cinch bags? I call them kinch bags. That could just be my uh, my accent. But look, they got little drawstrings too. Boom, beautiful, high quality, thick bags. Look at these big ones. These two big ones, I don't even remember what I bought to get these. You could use this for the gym. The rope is like, it's okay quality, but I mean, it's still good enough. Boom, you're ready to go to the gym. Boom, right there. You're ready to let everyone know like, yeah, I lift weights and I'm a nerd at the same time. These are the bags that I have the most. H&M bags, H&M bags. I don't shop them anymore, but I think this is H&M. Or it could be Forever 21, I don't know. I don't remember. In your Face. In your 10 cents per bag face. Who's ahead of the game now? This guy. I don't need any more bags. I'm set for the rest of my life. Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday, March 19th. It's the final day that I'm in Lincoln, Northern California in general. Um, I should probably start putting some boxes in my car and start packing things in my car because I don't even know if all the stuff's gonna fit. I had this expectation that I was only gonna bring a little bit of stuff, but after, you know, starting to pack all the smaller things and not just the big things, I have a lot more stuff than I thought. Just finished packing all like my tech gear. I was able to pack most of the things in here. Got my Xbox, my Kinect, a clock, studio monitors. In this little crevice right here, and these crevices right here, there's a bunch of wires. I'm hoping that this will be the last big box that I put in the car. I think I'm gonna take a break. It's been like, I don't know, two hours I would say. Hour and a half, two hours, and now I'm gonna go to the gym. And when I go there, I'm gonna cancel my membership. Good morning, everybody. It is Monday, March 20th, uh, 4.50 in the morning. It is move day. And before we go, I just wanted to show you guys my room. It doesn't look like there's much stuff gone, but trust me, there is a lot of stuff gone. I still have those. Um, Sounds way more echoey because there's nothing here anymore. But yeah, saying goodbyes to this room. I remember the first day I was excited to move down here with the new flooring, have more space to work. That was my work area, that was uh, Kathy's work area. Closet's empty too, pretty much. See, no more hangers. So I'm using my phone because 
I ran out of uh, space on my memory card for my ca uh, my Canon, my regular vlog camera. But yeah, that's it. We're gonna go to SoCal now, and I'll we'll see you there. Home. Yeah, I'm gonna miss this room a lot. A lot of fond memories in here. A lot of good memories. A lot of productive memories. Uh, a lot of gaming memories. Oh God, it's gonna be. This room is sentimental. But it's okay, I'll be back later on in the year.